Several Dallas police officers are under intense scrutiny. One has been arrested. That officer is accused of fabricating evidence against a man, while the others are now on administrative leave. J.D. Miles explains what happened. All new tonight at 10. This is Dallas police officer Jacob Hughes' mugshot taken after he turned himself into jail on a charge of fabricating physical evidence. His attorneys say the five-year veteran patrol officer is being unfairly prosecuted for an innocent mistake that didn't impact the outcome of a case. He's uh, a, a dedicated police officer who works hard and protects this city. Attorney Toby Shook says Hughes and five other officers were called to this hotel off I-30 in Buckner in December because someone was firing a gun from inside a room at cars on the freeway. Shook says they zeroed in on the room Terry Yearling was inside of from Hughes shell casings outside. The attorney says Officer Hughes later wrote in a police report that Yearling was arrested after he opened the door. But the evidence, Shook says, showed that Yearling did not open the door making the entry an illegal search. Attorneys for the officers say Hughes and other officers actually entered the room by coming down here to the front desk and getting a card key. The officers say that oversight of the report was a mistake, but not a crime. It's a simple matter of a mistake. Uh, some information was left out, uh, like lots of people do in their everyday lives. He's absolutely not guilty of these charges. There's uh, no evidence of criminal intent uh, that's required in this particular charge. But DPD Chief Eddie Garcia was less forgiving, issuing a statement which says, although I am extremely disheartened by what this investigation revealed, I am proud of the internal control measures performed by the supervisors that exposed the actions of those involved. The officer's attorney insists there was no intent by Hughes to frame Yearling, who pleaded guilty before the discrepancy in the report was discovered during a routine review of officer body cam videos. Shook says both the DA's office and Yearling's attorneys also missed it, suggesting it was not a crucial part of the case. I would think they would look at the law a little better than the facts and know uh, that they don't have a criminal case. In Dallas, J.D. Miles, CBS 11 News.